So this is something that is celebrated with reverence each year. It's the anniversary of the death of uh, Rabbi Joel Teitelbaum, the, the founder of the Sat Marasidim. Tens of thousands of people come here every year to worship at his grave site and uh, to, to, to pray and to ask uh, blessings from him. It's believed to be a very opportune time to evoke mercy from God on this very special day. We all need mercy and uh, that's what we're all here for. As the rift within Satmar has widened within recent years, it's become tense between supporters of the, the two Teitelbaum brothers, Aaron and Zalman. Zalman, who uh, presides in, in Brooklyn, is obviously entering uh, somewhat of any territory here when he comes to visit the cemetery, hence all the anticipation here awaiting his arrival. No pushing, guys. No pushing. Everybody stay in your place. I moved here 32 years ago. I was like a family. Brothers and sisters. Everybody liked each other. Everybody had respect for each other. And now it's, it's just a, two parties. That's what it is. And the youngsters. The youngsters make all these problems. And the money. Everybody wants to be the boss over the money. It's just a number of people come and there's a little pushing and shoving because of the excitement of the event, but generally it's a non-event for us. We were watching the uh, crowd of people going into the mausoleum there when the hisses of the crowd uh, suddenly grew into a much louder hiss. Didn't quite think tear gas, but that was the, uh, the reaction that um, people had. They were shouting gas and they were scattering. <laughs> But he panicked, you could smell gas. I didn't know what to think. Uh, Everybody, leave the area. Leave the area for your safety. Leave the area. There were people stepping on these old metals over here, and they used to have the uh, propane tanks, which used to heat the mausoleum. And somebody stepped on the valve, the valve broke off, and the uh, fire department removed it. So after about an hour inside the mausoleum, Rabbi Zalman and his uh, supporters came outside and made their way back to their SUV. Uh, there was still a big crowd there, and the state troopers were pushing people back. Uh, people were... Um, it wasn't any violent confrontations. It was just people um, shoving for uh, to see what was happening, and uh, that lasted for a few minutes, and then that was, that was the end of it. Move back! 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 Move